Hi, this is Andy from GPS Training. In this video, we're just having a quick look at the Garmin Messenger app and how we can use the Messenger app to control the tracking of our compatible in-reach device. So I'm just going to touch on the Messenger app icon for the app that I've already downloaded to my mobile phone. I've got it paired with my GPS Map 67 i unit which you can see when i touch on the devices tab in the bottom right that's what we're seeing on the screen you can use the messenger app with the likes of the garmin messenger device the garmin inreach mini 2 67i unit map 66i unit and the montana 700i and 750i so it's a nice app to use for simply sending messages we showed on earlier video how you can do messages initiate the SOS but in this video we're just looking at the tracking so this is where if you set up in your account a map share so that your friends and family can follow you on a map rather than starting the tracking automatically from your unit you can actually start it from the app by simply touching on the tracking in the bottom right and if I touch on the little cogwheel symbol to the far left I can change my intervals of how often I want the tracking to be sent. Bear in mind, this will depend on what in-reach package subscription you're paying for. If you're just paying for one of the basic safety packages, you will get charged per each track point. So just be careful when you do set up the tracking. If you're paying for one of the mid packages, tracking is included. So you could set it at 10 minute tracking and you're not going to get charged. But if you've just got one of the basic safety packages, bear in mind if we did set it at 10 minutes, we'd be getting charged 10 minutes for every track point. So if you did want to use the tracking for a one off event or something you're just not using on a regular basis, you may want to set it to something more like an hour, two hours etc so whatever you set that at when you're ready to go so you're outside with your device and you've got a satellite signal with your device you can then simply touch on the start tracking and that will start sending your track points initially it'll send the first point using satellites and then depending what you've set it'll send more track points and you have got the option at the bottom right where you've got the little paper clip symbol and you can share or send your tracking information or copy the link to then use your phone to send it to a family member just remember in your inreach account when you first set up your device you get the option there to set up map share so you have a web address that your friends and family click on to see where you are don't confuse this tracking with if you've got something like a handheld device like a gps map 67 66 the Montana inReach units. It's not the tracking where you track for your own use, where you're actually saving a track and a record of where you've walked to look back on what we call the activity recording. This tracking that we're looking at here is for friends and family so they can follow you using satellite um, messages that are, um, oh, sorry, satellite tracking that's sent via the Iridium satellite system so they can then pick up on your map share web address that you set up when you first set up your inReach account. It's so that friends or family can actually see your movements across the screen. It's not the same as the tracking that you're saving as an activity on your unit. And when I want to stop tracking, I can simply on the app, if I just close that screen down, I'd go back to the devices tab and where we've got that where it says updated one minute where it said tracking initially it's the fourth box down on the right just above message check to the right if i touch on that now i can select stop tracking and stop tracking and that has now stopped it close it down with a little cross and you can see i'm back to the main menu where it's got the word tracking so i hope you found this video useful on how you can use the app itself the garmin messenger app to actually initiate tracking on your device and stop the tracking if you have got an active inreach subscription and if you've paid for one of the subscriptions that either includes tracking or as long as you're aware that if you just got the safety package like i've got you would be charged 10 pence per track point i hope you found this video useful and thanks for watching